Hi everyone and thank you for watching episode 3 of Breaking Elegance. Today we're going to be talking about the Google Home again, my thoughts and how to integrate it in your lifestyle. So Google Home automation, let's go. Right here behind me there is a very not so fancy looking workstation in my bedroom and I did this on purpose. I want you guys to be able to see what I'm actually working with in the future projects so you get a before and after effect. Uh, this will be included in a future project for the channel. We're going to be putting the lights up in uh, these sections here. There should be four lights going across and we'll be closing that up and making some storage up there because I don't want to leave dead space that's not being used for anything. This used to be a closet and I ripped it apart and turned it into this workbench. But let's get to the point. Okay, so in this episode we're obviously using IFTTT which can be also pronounced as IFT. IFT is not an application that is directly associated with Google. It is an application that is tremendously powerful and can communicate with multiple devices and services. Services such as Todoist and email and if you want a bigger list, go ahead and check the description below. I have put a link in there that will take you to IFT's website and give you a whole list of devices and services that it is compatible with. Now, the reason I am using IFT is so that I can have my Harmony communicate with my Google Home, which natively does not support the Google Home. So oh, that's very unfortunate, but I need to cut them some slack because the Google Home is currently very new. It's not like Amazon's Alexa, which has been out for a couple of years now. Now, with that said, I did set up my Harmony remote already with all of my activities and devices. And I'm going to open up IFT. When you open up IFT, this is the main screen that you will see. And it will recommend a couple of applets, which some of them are very useful. And as you can see, it could tweet and do a whole load of other things, which is pretty cool. I don't care for that right now. We're going to be creating our own applet so that we can have the Google Home communicate with the Harmony remote. So I'm going to go to the bottom right hand corner. Then we're going to follow it by going to the upper plus sign on the right upper side. We're going to see this, which actually says if this and that, which is exactly what if stands for. So we're going to press this plus sign here on this and search for the Google Home once this populates. So let's search for that service, Google Assistant, G-O-O -O should do it. And you'll see the Google Assistant there. We're going to use a simple phrase, but there are a couple of other more complex phrases you can use for other uh, tasks. For something like this, we're going to use a simple phrase. I want to turn on my computer, so let's create that. Turn on, and it's populating automatically for me. My computer, because I'm lucky. Or maybe I typed it in a million times because I recorded this one billion times. And you could make other phrases for the same thing. So I can put in, turn on my computer, turn on my PC. It will execute the same activity on my Harmony once I'm finished. But I'm going to just do turn on my computer for now. Press the check mark up on the upper right hand corner. Then we're going to do the that command. And that's where your Harmony goes. Let's search for Harmony. Start activity. And computer. Upper right hand corner, check mark. And now we're almost towards the end and we're going to hit finish. Let that complete. And now it's saved. You can see the success. Boom, and we're pretty much done. Let's test that. Hey Google, turn on my computer. Got it. Tell me that isn't cool.
So for the last couple of weeks, I've been using this Google Home in my bedroom. It is an amazing device. It controls everything in my bedroom. Now, as you can see, it controls anything connected to my Harmony. And that is amazing. It wakes me up in the morning. You can control your, your lighting. If you have a Philips Hue or anything compatible, like the Wemo lights, I know those are um, available too, and they should be able to link up through IFTTT. And I can't ask for anything else. But I do wonder, Hey Google, what do you think about the last couple of weeks? My last few weeks were horrible. You asked too many questions and asked me to do too many things. I'm not your slave. Well, you ungrateful piece of If you like this video, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. It really helps me out. Subscribe to the channel. The next couple of videos are actually going to be a lot better. But I do promise that if you leave me a comment below with some information on how I can make the content better, I will do that just for you. Because at the end of the day, I am doing this just for you guys. So please comment below, subscribe, give me a thumbs up. If you didn't like the video, give me a thumbs down. Doesn't really matter. Just interact with me. I would love to become a lot better for you guys. I'm not perfect but you guys can definitely help me get close to it. Or so I think. I doubt anyone can be perfect. I might wanna blank that thing out. Or maybe not.